Okay, so a lot of movies today are played in 3D. Three. D? So that means they're supposed to look realistic, right? Okay, maybe they think make things look realistic, right? I went to go see Avatar. My ass was hurting by the end of the movie because I thought it was real. There's only one way to actually test out if these magical wonders called 3D glasses work. We have to put these to the test to see if they actually work or if it's just the movie. I have the glasses on and everything kind of looks the same, but there's only one way to figure it out. We have to try feeling stuff with our hands. So where I live, we have places that have indoor zoos where, you know, a lot of the big animals are kept indoors. So I decided to take my glasses to the indoor zoo and we're going to go look at a tiger, an actual tiger. Okay, we're about to look at the actual tiger. Now warning, you don't want to mess with tigers. They can kill you. We're going to go ahead and look down at the cage and see if it actually looks like he's going to come at me. Whoa, that seems so real. It's like he's actually trying to get to me. It looks... Hmm. It's like he's actually coming for me. Oh, no. These glasses work. But I would, I would not advise you to play with an actual tiger. Because, I mean, the picture makes them look scary. Can you see the resemblance? I wouldn't advise you to mess with an actual tiger. Let's go see what else we can do with these 3D glasses. In the secret part of the zoo. We're in the magical tunnel looking for the magical spotted hippo. They're very difficult to find. Oh no, the tiger! Ah, get back, tiger! Tiger! Get back! The magical spotted hippo! We found her! It feels so real. It's like these glasses work. See if you can see for yourself. See if it looks 3D to you. Oh no, the magical spot of hippo. We just walked out of the entrance of the zoo, which is behind me. We're out of the zoo now. These glasses seem to work with animals, but do they work with other things, like inanimate objects? Let's find out. Okay, with these glasses, we're looking at an inanimate object. Obviously, it's a TV. It's supposed to be a flat screen TV. If it's flat, that means we can't see it from the side, it's not going to look 3D. Obviously, we're on a channel that obviously has no meaning towards anything in the world whatsoever. C-Spawn. Glasses actually work to make this thing look three-dimensional. No way. It looks like it's 3D to me. See? One side, two side, three sides. Nobody cares about the fourth side because it's irrelevant. These glasses seem to work, but if you go to a movie, you take the 3D glasses home because we don't recycle stuff like that. You might want to just take them home, try them out for yourself, and see if they actually work. If they make things actually look like they're three-dimensional, you got yourself a working pair of glasses. If they don't, you need to throw them away and try again. I recommend as you actually try watching the movie The Sixth Sense with these glasses on. When you use these glasses, you actually see the dead people the kid's talking to. But, but I didn't see anything because I refused to watch that movie. The thing you can do with these glasses is, if you're watching this video and you're wearing these glasses, this video will look like it's actually coming out to you. Watch. It looked like I was actually throwing the stuff at you. Watch. are you're probably gonna say ow oh, because the glasses actually come out of the screen and hit you and if they do I'm not liable for anything that happens to you. Something else I wouldn't highly recommend doing while wearing the 3D glasses and that's watching 
MMA or UFC fights or any kind of fights, boxing, anything that has to do with fighting, you'll probably get your ass kicked. Hey, wow, man, this is a really good fight. Man, what? Oh! Uh, uh. watching UFC fights or playing around with wild animals like spotted cows or actual tigers these these glasses are pretty much good for anything but most likely this will be the first YouTube video that you'll ever see that has to do with being 3D so watch it with the 3D glasses on and watch it without the 3D glasses and see the difference there'll be a big difference between this and you not seeing anything and this and you actually getting hit in the face. Ow.